I have a Moto G power here. I'm going to be inserting the SIM card and SD card. Also, I'm going to be checking the mobile settings of the SIM card once inserted, as well as format the SD card. Okay. So the first thing is go ahead and grab your SIM ejection tool. The uh, SIM tray slash SD card tray is on the top left hand side. Your SIM ejection tool should have came out of your box in this like little pamphlet right here. There should be a uh, SIM ejection tool in here. Okay, here it is. It was stuck on top of the box up here, but here it is right here. Anyway, if you don't have that laying around, you can always use another SIM ejection tool from a different phone or even like a thin um, paper clip or bobby pin. Even the back of the stud earring that's nice and thin, that'll work as well. Okay, anyway, top left hand side, you're going to go ahead and see that little hole right there. It's going to put the needle in there and put some pressure. We're going to press in. And then the lip's going to come out just a little bit, so you can see it right there. And then go ahead and grab your fingernail and just pry that out. I'm going to leave it just like this. Now, if we go ahead and look at this, now here's the uh, SIM slot and here's the SD card slot. So for the SIM slot, if you, I, exactly like how I pulled it out. Now, if you look on the top left, left hand side, there's a diagonal slit. You want to mash that up with your SD card. Okay, you can only fit it in one way, so you really can't make a mistake. So we're just going to put it in there and just make sure that it's nice and uh, flat nice and flush and then with the SD card you just want to go ahead and face it right side up it only goes in one way as well so we're going to go ahead and pop it in just like this make sure that they're both in there nice and flush and then we're going to go ahead and slowly put this in okay so right now it says no SIM card so we're going to slide this in here just go really slowly make sure it doesn't come out of the uh, the grooves there, so I'm gonna go all the way in. It still says no SIM. Let's give it one second. I should find my carrier here. Okay, there we go. It says T-Mobile, which is my carrier in US, and I also see the reception bars. So I know that the um, the SIM card is in properly. Now, let's just double check the mobile settings of the SIM card. So just go to your settings app right here. And then from here, you wanna tap on network and internet right there. And then it says right here, mobile network. Right here, let's go ahead and tap on that. Now you can see by default, they automatically turn my roaming, my data roaming off. I like to leave mine on because I have unlimited data roaming, but some of you guys may be charged uh, data roaming or up to a certain limit. So just um, FYI, okay, look out for that. And also you can look at the other settings down here. Like you can see my preferred network type is on LTE. Okay, so my SIM card is up and running. Now let's go ahead and format the SD card. So SD card, we want to format it. So go to your settings again. And then from here, you just want to go ahead and scroll down and go to storage. Let's tap on storage. And then you see down here, portable storage. It should say SD card down here. If it doesn't say it on here, then either your SD card is corrupted or you basically need to reinsert it. Mine's right here. I have a Samsung SD card. Let me just go ahead and tap on that. And then from here, the top three dots, let me tap on that. And then we're going to go to storage settings right here. And now we can go ahead and format the SD card from here. Don't forget, if you guys format the SD card, it's going to erase everything on there. So if you anything important, back it up before you do this. Okay, anyways, let's format this. Click on Format, Format SD card. Right there, you see a status bar here. Give this one second. And there you go. Your SD card is ready for use. Go ahead and click on Done. And there we go. SIM card SD card is in and ready to go.